Hello guys, welcome back to Coding Cafe. So in the previous video tutorial we left here. So we created uh, the Flying Fish Game App project in our in Android Studio, and we have our this main activity. Now the thing which we will be doing in this tutorial is to create a splash screen activity. So whenever our app starts, then we will display that splash screen. So for doing that, first of all, you can simply uh, click here click new and let's create another activity an empty activity and let's call this empty activity as uh, splash activity click finish and you can see that our splash screen activity is created successfully so this is our activity splash.xml file click on text and now here we can start work So first of all change this constant layout to the relative layout so we can set relative layout and now inside this what we gonna do we are going to use some icons which are these okay the splash icon the splash and these two hurt okay and these okay so the link to these icons and the splash screen will be available in the description down below you can simply click on that link and download all these uh, seven icons okay from there so what we're gonna do you can simply copy all these and now let's go to go back to our android studio and here you can see this drawable folder you can simply click here and here you can simply click on this showing explorer and you can see this drawable folder double click there and paste your these seven icons here if i show you then these are our icons so the link to this will be available in the description down below so you can simply click on that and download all these seven icons now what we're going to do the next thing is to uh, add a background here on our this splash activity so we can set background and inside the drawable folder we have uh, a splash background okay by this name splash which we just passed inside the drawable folder you can see that here it is okay splash.jpg so yeah that's it and now the next thing is to add a fish icon here okay this will be our splash screen so we can say image view it should start with capital i image view 300 dp will be our layout width and 300 dp will be the layout height let's give it some id so the id of our this image view will be let's call it as image view and then we will have make it at the center so we can say center horizontal true and let's add the source so the source for this is inside the drawable folder we have an icon by the name splash underscore icon if I show you then this one okay so you can see that this fish appear here at the center now we need a text view so we can set text view match parent wrap content and let's give it some id so the id for this will be let's call it as text view one text view one let's give it the text so and a text and the text will the app name or you can set the game name which is the flying fish and the text alignment will be text alignment it should be center and the text color should be color ascent and the text size should be 30 sp oh it is the text style not the text style so let's make the text style to bold okay now we can set text size and the text size will be 34 sp so you can see that here okay now here you can simply write for the image view here we can say layout below instead of that you can simply write below and it will appear okay which is this one android layout below id and copy the id of text view one which is text view one and pass that text view one here so you can see that the icon be 
move uh, below a little bit okay and now here for the text view here we can say align parent start to true align parent top to true and margin from the top should be 70 dp so also change this uh, 70 dp to 130 dp so it will look good at the center so if you want you can add other text view here at the bottom if you want to upload this app on google play store and if you want to display your name or your brand name or company name here that is let's say developed by Mohammed Ali or developed by coding cafe whatever you want so you can add many text view here if you want so in this video we just designed our activity splash.xml file and in the next video we will write code for the splash screen to appear for five seconds whenever a user start or whenever a user start this app on his mobile phone so yeah that's it for this video and if anyone is new to our channel then please subscribe our channel coding cafe thumbs up for this video and see you guys in the next video bye for now